Halsey made a powerful entrance as she arrived at Audacity's annual Weekend Survive concert in Los Angeles on Saturday. The pop musician, who goes by both they and she pronouns, donned a black look featuring a crop top and pleated skirt. The eye-catching outfit was complete with long black leather gloves that stretched over her elbows. Halsey was one of the event's multiple headliners who perform each year in support of suicide prevention. The New Jersey-bred stunner, 28, finished her outfit with slouchy black leather cowboy boots that had red lettering on the front. Halsey, real name Ashley Frangipain, showed off a slither of her toned tummy in the dress, which connected the top and bottom portions with safety pins. She displayed her many tattoos in the ensemble, which had an open back with crisscrossed straps. The singer-songwriter's crop dark hair was softly spiked, allowing her to put her stunning visage front and center. Halsey, who founded makeup brand About Face, displayed her knack for beauty with expertly applied makeup. Her already strong cheekbones were even more defined with a sharp contour and blush combination. She made her eyes pop with complimentary shadow, liner, and voluminous lashes. Finally, on her mouth she stained her lips with a glossy deep red hue. The Bad at Love hitmaker took to her Instagram stories on Saturday to promote show, which was held at the storied Hollywood Bowl. Alanis Morissette jumped on stage to belt out her classic hits for the crowd in a sparkling silver coat. The 48-year-old Canada-born star delighted fans as she sang with a corded microphone in hand. She wore her long brunette hair down, letting the locks fall over her shoulders and down her back with various braids plaited throughout. The mother of three looked beautiful in a face of light makeup with colorful eyeshadow. Her short, natural nails were painted orange and she engaged with the audience as she got close to the edge of the stage to interact with fans. Stopping by the show's red carpet before hitting the stage was 19-year-old Tate McRae. She was dressed in long, light wash, cut-off denim shorts with frayed hems. The Canadian talent wore a green and black striped sweater underneath a black leather moto jacket. Her brunette hair was styled in a slick center part and two low-hanging braids on either side of her head. The men of music group One Republic were there as well, putting on a coordinated display in black outfits. Brent Kutzel, Drew Brown, Ryan Tedder, Brian Willett, Zach Filkins and Eddie Fisher were present as they supported the life-saving cause. Long-time performers Duke Erickson, Shirley Manson, Steve Marker and Butch Vig of the band Garage made their presence known as well. Shirley Manson stood out in a colorful floral frock, which nicely complemented her soft orange dyed curls. The guys of Weezer, Patrick Wilson, Brian Bell, Rivers Cuomo and Scott Schreiner turned up for the yearly gathering. They were dressed in their typically casual style, with three out of the four bandmates sporting eyeglasses. The Los Angeles-formed band looked happy to be at the concert as they smiled for photos on the red carpet. Tate McRae rocked the stage in a red jersey and sporty black and white fingerless gloves. The young talent had a team of backup dancers behind her, who wore inverse colors of the same gloves. One Republic put on a fiery set during the show, taking to Instagram afterward to share images with their two. 4 million followers. They wrote in the caption, Hollywood Bowl tonight we can survive.